authorities have revealed the identity of an Ohio man who killed himself in 2002 while using the name of an 8-year-old boy who died in a 1945 car accident. U.S. Marshal Peter Elliott at a news conference Thursday in Cleveland said DNA testing, genealogy and sleuthing helped determine that Joseph Newton Chandler III was actually 76-year-old Robert Ivan Nichols. Elliott says it's not known why Nichols broke contact with his family in 1965 and appeared 13 years later in Cleveland as Joseph Chandler, working as a draftsman and electrical engineer. The late Ivan Nichols was a Navy veteran during World War II, in which he earned a Purple Heart. Family members said he burned his uniform after he returned home from the war. Elliot says he hopes the public can provide some answers about Nichols's past. He adds that a record search found no crimes committed by Nichols under either name and that $82,000 was left to his name at the time of his death with no listed next of kin. Company workers have described him as intelligent and eccentric. Elliot said during the press conference there is suspicion about the late Ivan Nichols. Typically, when people are hiding, when people are scared, it's typically fugitives on the run, Elliot said. There's a reason he went missing and assumed the name of a deceased eight-year-old boy in 1978 and hid for so many years. Ivan Nichols' son, Philip Nichols, who hadn't heard from his dad since 1965, also spoke at the press conference. Share this article Share this put to arrest a mystery in our family what happened to him. We're grateful the discoveries have been made, the son said. I'm at peace and hold no animosity, no anger. I wish it had turned out differently. Some have likened Ivan Nichols' appearance to the drawings of the serial Zodiac killer who bragged in anonymous letters to police that he allegedly killed 37 people. At least five people were confirmed dead in the 1960s and 1970s killings that took place in Northern California and San Francisco. Ivan Nichols also reportedly made electrical devices, according to WKYC3, which was said to be a hobby of the Zodiac Killer. There's a reason he never again contacted his family, Elliot added. Robert Ivan Nichols never wanted to be found throughout his lifetime and into his death, and someone out there may hold the key as to why.